is you can get slotted into the friend with benefits category permanently with a guy who might have wanted something more with you. It's true, right? Some guys, they put you into different categories. And if you're just like, hey, let's just hook up. Even if it's the first time, even if you're a virgin when you got to this, right? Guys are going to look at you when you do that. And they're going to think in their minds, she does this all the time. And you're going to say, I never do this. And he's going to think, yeah, right. And this happens all the time. I hear it from guys. I hear it from women. I hear it from everybody. And he, he, if he slots you into that category, if he's like, oh, well, she, you know, isn't, she's not the kind of girl that I'd be looking for in a relationship because guys look for certain things in the relationship. And one of those things is not she hooks up with every dude, right? And if he feels like you're that kind of a girl, then he, there's a much higher probability chance that he's going to think that you're going to do that in a relationship or that you're not faithful or that you're not loyal or that you do, you just do it a lot. And it might end up happening to him if you guys are, end up in a relationship and he might end up slotting you into this not relationship material category, which can be a big problem if you end up wanting to get into a relationship with him later on. And you can also end up feeling really used by this, right? Like you could be in this situation and he's not taking care of your needs. He doesn't really care about your needs. He doesn't, all these different things, right? Because you're just hooking up and that's, that's how he feels about it. He's like, hey, this is just physical. And so a lot of women end up coming back and they're like, well, now I just feel like I'm, I've been used for the last three weeks, three months, three years, you know, 10 years. We have women in our community that ha have been in friend with benefits situations for up to 17 years where the guy still doesn't want anything more and they're still chasing after it, hoping that it'll one day, because they're, they've got that sunken cost theory going in where they've spent so much time and energy and effort with this guy that they're like, I don't want to let him go. Right. But they're stuck in it because the guy's like, I've never seen her that way and I still don't see her that way. And it's just really, really sad.